I've been anxious to show the Uni RPG community uh, what I've been working on. Uh, you probably noticed that uh, you often add items to your scene. Here's my double-handed cleaver. And as you can see, it, uh, it doesn't have an icon. That's really, really common. Uh, now, what I would normally need to do is I'd normally need to take this model, move it into a spare window. I'd need to then take a screenshot and then, then to go to, to Adobe Photoshop. I then have to uh, wizard out the background. I then have to replace the background and add a foreground. I have to do an enormous amount of stuff uh, that really takes me away from what I'm trying to do, which is make an RPG. So uh, what I'd like to show you here is what I've been working on, which will uh, highlight for you just how easy and how quick it is going to be to create uh, icons in the near future. What I do is I select my uh, my item here, and uh, what I'll do is uh, go to window, Mud Animations, Icon Creator. This is a dockable window, I like to put it here. What you can see here is that it's uh, it's showing me uh, a little square, a 256 by 256 square. I'm going to just aim at my uh, at my sword, the part of the sword I want as part of the icon. You can see here it's selected, two-handed cleaver. I can set the resolution for what I want. Uh, I'm going to have a resolution of 256. Uh, I can set the background. I'm going to set the background being, well, for argument's sake, I'm going to make it the same blue as this background of the sword. I'm going to quickly select a background. Uh, that's the background. I'm going to select a highlight to give it a highlight. With this thing selected, I'm going to click on create icon. As you can see, it's still in development phase and that didn't work. And that one did. Uh, and we'll go into assets here and give assets a second. It'll be easy to go this way. This is my assets folder. Icons, and there it has created the icon. That's super super simple. So if eventually this thing catches up, icons. So in a cleaver, here it is. I've got my overlay, I've got my background, I've even got my background colour, and I've got my sword as it's shown in uh, my little reticule here. So uh, all I do now is obviously select my sword again and say, uh, I type in the name of it, two-handed cleaver, and there's two-handed cleaver underscore icon. Done. A few seconds, and now my, uh, uh, my weapon has its icon. So uh, hopefully what this means is uh, people can use this to... Uh, really get into their RPG games and uh, not have to worry about creating of icons. Uh, thanks a lot for watching.